Right, so we got pre-love vintage this time um, and uh, we got the 5kg box so we need to see what we've got this time. Um, it got ripped on the way anyway but I mean it's still fine. So everything in here is what we're going to go through. First one, it's a plain black polo top. Uh, not sure about the size. It doesn't have the size on it. It's got a black colour Adidas. It's quite new. We've got just a plain t-shirt from Tommy the figure. Feeler one and plain printed. Okay, so um we've got this polo again, Nike one printed size L. So um this is a vintage one, it's a plain. Um we don't really got a flannel shirt for XL should be alright. It's quite nice. Got a polo Raph Lauren size L all the buttons are there. It's a bit of a mark on the cuff though. I always check the buttons with these because you can always find a couple of them missing sometimes. It's not bad, but it's got a little mark in there. Plain Adidas track, size L. You know what, for this time, I think it'd be perfect in the lockdown and stuff. Um, we've got a Nike hoodie, That's a size S. They, they sell quite often. Sometimes the simple ones are the best ones because a lot of people they like these night tops um, quite a new adidas top so it's quite plain quite clean as well the good thing about this company is they wash the stuff before they um before they send out a lot of them they don't really wash it so this is quite good we've got um a Ralph Lauren quarter zip uh, I think part of the zip is probably broken. Size L, good size. Got Adidas track jacket. Uh, size 16 ladies. Problem with these, I don't know if you notice it, but I mean, they, they have all these bubbles, so you might need something to remove it. Luckily with these, um, if you don't, you could find it online, about 20 pounds, like a machine, you put battery, and it kind of like just takes off the bubbles so you could get rid of that but again i think this is something that wholesaler should check again and uh, this one has quite a bit actually it's quite a lot yeah it's got black mark here pen dots or something like that i don't think that will wash off and then it's got a bit of wear in there that's pink i don't know why but size s might make about 10 15 on this not too sure exactly. Again, Adidas track jacket. It's all right. Um, I'll price them in terms of how much they probably get. They probably get about 10, 10, probably 15. Same with this one again, 10, 15. Probably this one as well, 10 to 15. This probably make around 25, 30. This probably around 20, 25. This probably around 25, 30 or something. It's quite clean. It's got a bit of elastic in there, about 25, probably 20. This one with the mark probably around 20. It's unbranded, we normally sell them around 15 to 20, so they should be alright. These probably go for around 15, it's 
really nice for the summer, it's really lightweight. And then with the polo, we tend to keep, just keep most of them around 15. If it's a good quality one, it should be around 15. For the plane, you kind of like bundle it up and then sell it together. So five pound if you're lucky, probably on, on the plane ones. Um, but then having said that, a lot of people just wear it as a lounge. So who knows, it might sell. Um, with the t-shirts, we aim for around five to 15 if it's a plain one it's probably more closer to five and then obviously if it's more nicer then we sell it around 15 like this probably go for around 15. it does have a bit of fading in there uh no size tags but i mean still nice so i think we spent 90 all together including the delivery um and it's good i mean like it's modern that's probably you don't really find the vintage stuff in there um whether you want to buy it or not i mean give it a go we might i mean we've done the hand picks in the events and you tend to find a lot of people they just buy it get rid of it quickly so um i think online is not a bad idea again if you like anything just uh follow us or give us a message and then we tend to bundle things up as well so make sure you look out for the mystery not so mystery boxes from us as well uh thank you very much